Welcome to Azure Everyday with Pragmatic Works. My name is Steve Hughes. I'm a principal consultant with Pragmatic Works. And today I would like to talk with you about the advantages of using the ARM deployment model within Azure. We get asked a lot about the difference between uh, ARM and Classic. And realistically, you may be in a situation where you're either starting out and trying to understand what ARM is, or if what Classic is. We believe that you should be focused entirely on ARM. And I'm gonna give you a number of reasons why. Uh, this is the Azure Re Resource Manager, Re Resource Manager, deployment model, ARM for short. And you'll hear a lot of things like ARM templates. Why would I want to use that? Let's talk through, uh, I've got six reasons why you wanna really look at using ARM and why it should matter for you in this environment and why it should be the way you should look at it. First of all, ARM lets you deploy, manage, and monitor all of the Azure resources for an application or a specific solution as a group. And it can include almost every resource within Azure. There are some that are still only classic. Uh, we're not gonna worry about those now. The other thing is, as you do ARM template deployment, you're gonna be able to deploy as a unit, but not just once. You'll be, you're gonna have the ability to deploy multiple times through the life cycle of your application. And you're gonna be able to manage that deployment process. So that's reason two is you're gonna have this an, an ongoing process. You make a change in your application, you change your deployment in ARM, and you're gonna have this opportunity to move forward with that. The access control, so access to the resources can be managed as a unit. So as you start thinking about how to do separation of duties and compliance from SOCs, for instance, you may have specific rules around the application that you're doing, you can apply access control to that. And then that, those rules apply in general to that, in, that entire deployment uh, solution that you have. Resources can be tagged. This is really nice if you're in a large Azure environment. Um, our organization has a lot of uh, components and different things we support using Azure, of course. And some of those we need to tag. We need to say, hey, this is, all these things are logically grouped together for whatever purpose, for purpose of identifying them within the list of resources we are using to identify them in billing. There's a lot of opportunity around using ARM templates and ARMs to, uh, the ARM deployment model to tag your resources for that purpose. I have mentioned templates over and over and over again. So that is really reason number five, templates. Why templates? Why do they matter? Well, JSON templates can be created to actually configure your entire pattern. So this allows you, if you're doing um, a standard application rollout, and maybe you have a base template you even use, that you can actually create this template. It has all the really important things in there. It can be parameterized, and then you can issue out and deploy your resources as a group using the template. Very cool feature, um, very robust uh, along all the resources that are available. You can also define the dependencies to make sure that it's deployed in the correct order. So this is reason six. One of the hardest things to do is keep all this straight. Do you want to manage it in PowerShell or do you want to manage it in template and use this deployment model to get it out? You should absolutely look at ARM for that. So those are the six top reasons we have for using ARM deployment. The seventh bonus reason is you shouldn't use Classic because it's probably going to go away. We don't know when that would be or how that looks, but almost every new thing in Azure is going to ARM first. So if you're going to be new, if you're new to Azure or you want to take advantage of new tech, use ARM. Any other questions around this or anything else around ARM and classic deployment models? Click the link below for more information. Thank you.